Now, Lisa Hyper may not have been among the hot names of summer 2018. No squad, pull up a shot. But she's definitely not out of the dance hall game. Some yellow be little bit in me. For now that the summer is winding down, the former lady, first lady of Gaza, seeks to be at the forefront of the last quarter with her treasures. Me as the treasure. And uh, she'll be coming here with a bag of them. Three other artists seeking to impact 2018 before it's over are Versi with the voice that includes Bounty Killer. No things get rough again, tough again. And the protege's protege, Leela IK with Second Chance. I you, babe. While OCG tells why man cheat. They are ready to put their stamp on the last quarter of 2018 and on our stage. Welcome to the show, everyone. I am Winford Williams. We'll be right back. Original bad girl Lisa, make your mouth loud like you're the past speaker. And daddy the apple vodka, the creeper. Reaching more and more screens around the world every week. On stage, so much more than entertainment. Her name has been popping up all over the Roots Rock reggae space, especially among the Neo Roots crowd. She's the protege of protege. Can you believe that? And joins us right now, right here on our stage with her claim to fame and her latest project, Leela IK, right now. <laughs> Welcome, Leela. Ah, it's good to have you. Okay, so talk about your journey to this, thus far in music. Well, thus far, it's definitely been a blessing. Mm -hmm. To be honest, I did not expect to end up here so quickly. <laughs> you know? um, so I'm very humbled by that. But it's been, you know, you have ups and downs. Mm -hmm. I think my biggest struggle are on this journey is like getting my mom to allow me to, you know? To do music? Yeah. She's not into it? Well, she's into it now. <laughs> <laughs> you, but, you won her over already? So, yeah, she, so initially she pushed back. Yeah, because she was, you know, kind of scared. Oh, you want to move to Kingston? You know, I grew okay. up very sheltered, so. Oh. And I decided, you know, I'm going to move out and go do my thing. She was not so comfortable with it. Okay. Well, pause it right there for a bit. <laughs> and let's go now to the protege's protege yeah. part of things. And I suppose he had something to do with mom kind of letting go. Definitely, because um, when I first... I uh, started to link with Protégé. I began to tell her that, oh, you know, I'm working with Protégé now. No, she's like a big fan of his music. Okay. You know, so he actually came by my house in Manchester. And she was like, whoa, and you know. And asked yeah. for your hand in music. <laughs> in music, basically. <laughs> so she was like, no, man, he's a good man, man. Me like, me like the music where I make it look like him. We keep you in the, on the right road. So. Yes. Yes, guys, he's been yeah. talking about you. The last time he was here, he was talking about you. Yeah, man. Big up protege, He was man. telling me about you and that you will be one to watch. In fact, <laughs> he was saying it publicly on, on the set, on yeah, stage. Yeah, That's right. That's right. Okay. No, but apart from your mom, though, what, what other struggles um, have you had and been experiencing um, in your quest? Um, I'd say um, basically because I'm, I moved out of my mom's house, started living in Kingston by myself. Mm -hmm. So, you know, I'm now catering for myself, started living on my own. Oh. And, you know, coming out of sheltered a very... Sheltered girl? You see me? Coming out of a very sheltered country lifestyle, mm -hmm. moving to Kingston with, you know, the city is moving so fast. And then, I mean, look at my size, you know? Mm -hmm. People are always just trying to, you know? Just some negative vibes arise more while I'm here just... Firm up and take on the journey certain ways. So. <laughs> Can you repeat? You know? Is it me? <laughs> the, the, the I'm, a, I'm a very easy stand, target. So. That's what you meant by our size, okay? Yeah, you know? Oh, so, yes, especially but, as a young woman, I try to do this. It really takes a lot. It, and it's tough. So it's really a man's world from your perspective? No, definitely not. It's Women not a man's can world. Do it, I mean, that's what I'm doing. Yes. But, you know, we definitely have, have a lot of fight to put up as women. Yes. In music, you know? But, all right, so I'm sure everybody's dying to hear <laughs> right now your second chance. Yeah. <laughs> the record. Let, let's go. Can we fall in love like we did before? Can I show you how much I adore you, babe? Come make me go fall in love. Know you love the style, especially the robot. All right, she's Leela.
Bueno, hay que darse el segundo chance. Amén. You're in? I'm in, 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 i am on spot <laughs> country is just oozing yeah. out to that. Yeah, man, for sure. The composition, though, the, the writing, the lyrics are yours? Yes, and more until I said that song, they never necessarily completely um, penned down. Yeah. You know, I remember going to the studio, big up Sprocket, big up Silma General, you know, and when I went there, I basically, it was the first time he might meet me and thing is his um, nephew. Right, we used to go to university together and he was like, yo, you know, my uncle has a studio and I really think it's your kind of vibe and what I like. But I'm kind of skeptical about going to studios because how me stay, if I go in a studio and I hear something more I love, they go, a song is going to happen right mm -hmm. there. And then I usually people take advantage of that. So I was like, mm, I don't know, but he convinced me and I went. I went there when basically they wanted to do an audition to see what I'm capable of. So the engineer, Chumri now like a shots. Mm -hmm. The engineer put on a soca rhythm and said, no man, this looks like a fair style. <laughs> you know? really? And it's like, the person I was with, Dennis Gratis, who's a producer, is like, no man, give her one of the oldest kind of rhythm you can find, a one drop. And Ella said, eh, let me see the, the rhythm, let me play it to them, let me see if she can deal with it. And when I went in the studio and hear the bass line, I'm telling you that, that song just came out of me. I remember the man turn around because him, they turn him back and I listen and I see him turn around and I look for me. From that day, I goosebumps him call me. Effortlessly, that song just came out of me. So oh, I just saw wow. it go sometime, you know? So they thought you were something. Uh, <laughs> not disrespect to Soka, but no, you know, but like, you know? like a frivolous, fun song kind yeah. of girl. No, yeah, really cool. I mean, I, say, I, mean yes. I was going to do something on that rhythm, you know, but. This is definitely where I'm comfortable. This is my kind of vibe. I grew up in the country. I listen to Wolipa, Sizzlan, Garnet, Silk, and yeah, Bujo, yeah, yeah. and Itana, Queen Africa, and, you know? Okay, so, you, so that was in Kingston? The studio. Yeah, man, definitely. Um, that's Sapphire music. So what's going on? What was going on in your mind? Country? And it's clean energy and love. <laughs> well, out honest, there you in know, the I remember in the studio actually just before. And Manchester, is right? No, man, Manchester, 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 I'm a Manchester. Come from. oh, yes. Jobly um, and Christiana. Christiana. My right. place, that. Porter did tell me that. I'm yeah. Sorry. <laughs> so a protege at St. Elizabeth. Yes. Yeah, I remember being in the studio and trying to figure out, okay, what am I going to do? And this is while when I heard the bass line, right? Just mm -hmm. before the first. That was me thinking, where am I, what's the direction I'm going with this? I'm going to say, a Bob Marley post line, I'm going to say, I'm going to use them line here. And I don't know, me just hear, as from the beat drop, my baby told me that he's going away. And you weren't experiencing anything like that? Who knows? Or maybe. <laughs> maybe. Maybe. So or maybe I for you. overheard somebody, you know, <laughs> disclosing what's happening with them. But music for me definitely always comes from a space of truth. Yes. But on my experience or somebody else's. And that's why I can come across like this. So that's going to be your lane yeah, in music. Yeah, for sure. You're just going to stay right there and express your, uh, your, some just truth. Just express the truth. I mean, that's what it should be. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. Know? Music is really feeling. And that me get when me listen to certain artists. Mm -hmm. Garnet Silk is my favorite artist. And every time I listen to him, I'm, I'm, I'm feeling what he's, you know, what he's experiencing while recording or whatever inspired that song. OK. So what were you studying in? What did you study in, right, in so the university? In university, I was actually studying to become a teacher. Mm -hmm. You know, my focus was on business and literacy. You know, but you know, things get difficult. I'm a mother alone. Yes. So I, I stopped in my second year in, and I decided, you know what, things are getting difficult. I'm going to go get a job and, you know, come out town and deal with my thing by myself. And I got a call center job. At the time, I did not know what call centers were. I checked some mega in my office and some <laughs> little phone call them or whatever, but turns out that was not the case. Yeah. And so it definitely was not making enough for me to send myself back to school. However, I managed to still do a semester at the University of the West Indies, where I was like, all right, I can't transfer my credits, but I'm going to do something that can definitely help me with what I'm praying for music. And so I started doing a linguistic um, study there. 
and you know, got poetry sessions, and that's where I met a lot of the people who really got me into music, like, you know, to free up and just express okay. myself. I see. So you're a creative writer, too. Yeah, <laughs> I'd like to think so. Okay. I'm a creative expressor, that's the thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, so, and where you want to go with this? this oh, God, man, thing? what may I try to do right now, or what I'm going to do, is mm -hmm. I want to be as big as Bob Marley. Okay. Right? As a woman in a music, I want my messages to live longer than I, mm -hmm. than I will, for sure. I just want to be, you know, very impactful. And more than, more than anything, I just want to inspire other young ladies. You know, if you just uplift themselves, you don't necessarily have to be, you know, displaying a particular party. You don't have to use your body for anything. I mm -hmm. did this without going through any of that. God bless protégés, your fame and Melanie, you know? <laughs> yes. I, I was not planning to ever get caught up into that. And you know, that's the kind of vibe I curate from you. From you come around me, you know, saying so I'm a joke thing with that one, yeah. for sure. So I'd like to inspire as much people as I can and just continue doing the thing as, you know, positive and, as And ever. you know, it, it's, um, we can't, we can't um, give enough praises to the near roots so-called neuros. We, we like to call yeah, them man, that. Yeah, man, for sure. And the protégés and the chronics and those youngsters. Yeah, nine. Who, who have, nine yes, one of my biggest All of them who have come forward. For sure. And, and kind of arrest mm -hmm. the, um, the scene. They, they just, they invaded the space. For sure. And they weren't um, selective about it. They just come in there and decided that they're coming with their own vibe and they're going to win souls for, for what they're doing and they're empowering somebody like yeah, you now sure. and I show you you don't have to be that you know, you yeah, know Janine sure. as you've mentioned and mm -hmm. others who have joined forces with them mm -hmm. and when young people the youth are on to them yeah. big time and that's an important that's a, a critical um, they came at a critical time in our, Definitely. In our, in our evolution, very necessary. in our space, in our music, to give young people an alternative. And for young sure. artists too, because yeah, we sure. always think about the consumers. We don't think no, about man. young artists like you now. Listen, I remember when I used to watch all of them on YouTube, because I couldn't go anywhere, you know. My mother yes. didn't allow me to leave the house none at all. So I, you know, I, I got into the internet, that was my escape. And with music now, I live on YouTube. And I remember coming across Protege, Chronix, Kabaka, Dre Island. I'm like, yo, these men are really doing it. And then we find Jana, and I'm like, wow, yeah. like, this content blows my mind because at the time I was not on that level of consciousness. It's great to have you, Lila. It's such a pleasure to be here. Thank you so much. This is a blessing. And it's a blessing to have you. And you're inspiring me too. So Blessings. We'll be watching you and we'll be reporting Thank your progress. Thank you so much. Give thanks. Thank you. Broto, much respect, sir. <laughs> you said it. You said we are going to have to call her, and we have. Big up yourself, Diggy Dan. Bless you. King Dig. <laughs> <laughs> All right, still to come right here on stage. More names seeking to impact 2018 before it's over. OCG and Versi. And later, Gaza's former first lady, Lisa Hyper. All coming up. We will back. We have the treasure, we have the treasure. Ooh. Reaching more and more screens around the world every week. On stage, so much more than entertainment. Two buzzworthy tracks and a voice that deems him undeniably talented. Me want by us and can't be give mama. He goes by the name OCG. It clear me be a big girl, say me want you. And he perhaps has the answer to the question, why do men cheat? <laughs> On our stage right now, OCG. Bless it, sir. Long Good to meet you. Fred. Yeah, man. Long overdue. Long overdue. Okay, explain why you say that. I mean, um, if yeah. anybody remember OCG, remember me from Best Friend Girl. Well, you would not do if your best friend can show up on your yard. Okay. And that was a massive hit at the time. Mm -hmm. that, that song was running the entire Jamaica, you understand? And then everybody actually wonder what happened with that song and what happened, why it never, you know, mm -hmm. propelled to another level. You understand? So that's why I said that. 
Okay, great. And you were called out as one of the big voices in the yeah, music. Yeah, yeah, With great potential. Still, still is. So do you think you were derailed? Why the delay? Why I, you, I mean, you, you know? the industry, as, as you know, dance hall is a cutthroat industry. Yes. You understand? And me as a youth, that cannot be controlled. You oh. understand? That that that, that, are, that are basically one of the biggest problems we see. Them have them are try to mold me into somebody that I am not. Okay. I'm not gonna be that type of person. I'm not gonna say nothing else from where make me creative or what come out of my soul. You understand? Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna stray from who OCG is for please nobody and nobody at all. You okay. understand? No producer, no, no manager, producer, no, no manager, manager, no nobody. So you will be a force by yourself with all the. It's not a force by myself, you know. What I need people to understand that. It's music business. Yes. So deal with business. So where are you drawing the line? Because it sounds like you, when you say, nobody can tell you what to do and so on. I mean, at the time, at the time, because we never ever thought nothing. Um, everybody was on this main thing of changing who he is. So it means then that you have creative control of yourself, yes, of your I've talent. I, I, you see, as an artist, what you need to do at all times is protect yourself. Yes. What makes you you is what makes the type of songs you sing okay. come out of your Fair mouth. Fair enough. Yeah, it is. You understand? If you take that away from an artist, then you're going to have an artist struggling to find words to say. Okay. And that is how. I don't write pen to paper, you know. If anybody can tell you, just play a beat and me just start speaking. So what you found in your, in your quest mm. for a place in music mm -hmm. was that people weren't listening to who you are. Exactly. They want to do something else. They want it. They just take you for face value. Yeah, wanted. and then... That, and you can't subscribe. No, you can't, can't fit. Can't, can't, you're saying... can't fit. I can't be comfortable with that. You understand? Okay. can't be comfortable with that. None at all. No so problem. you have to have a say in how you deliver, how you flow, how you're produced. How I'm produced. You understand? And, and, watch and that is the essence of why you're delayed somewhat, you're saying. And, and, that's and, the reason why yeah, you're delayed? Yeah, that's, 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 that's a part okay. of it. You understand what the, 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 the major section of everything right now, understand um, me and my management, my past management is not working together anymore. Mm -hmm. And then all of a sudden, you see me I get left off of rhythms and all type of things. So I don't know, so the meet and keep and everybody say bench OCG. You understand? So <laughs> we know how the thing go. Okay. So, oh, you decided to not, not wait on the bench, but no, to, no, to me walk don't, away from it. I don't deal with bench business, <laughs> brother. I don't the feel the same way. Send right. some security if you take me off them. Send, You understand? All right. So, okay. So, so that, this is where you are. So where would you say the career is now? Would you say a boss with, with, with them big song there? Or, or, um, <laughs> or right. you still a look a boss? I am I'm, I'm going to say me still a look a boss. Every single soul inside of Jamaica knows best friend girl. A yes, lot yes. of people did not, so, was, wasn't familiar with my face. So that's a breakout song. No, they are. No, why man cheat? No. Remember, you know, everybody was like, all right, boom, he yes. make a hit, him can't hit again. Me hit again. Yes. Oh, son, can't forgive mama, tired of this stress. Hit. Yes. Not because you watch me cheat and press me claws. Hit. I have a new song I promote, no name, name come for um, Emmanuel, for Moody Records, who mm -hmm. produce Yeah, Yeah, you understand? Why you don't bring your body come? So me can make your body come. Give me your body now. So, even the style and the flavor we have new. Yes. If you realize. Yes. You understand? And when me, when me get that big break there, the entire sound of dance all got change. And then when, the when that big extensive break comes, because we run know away, that runaway break there. Because, yeah, everybody knows me, I'm popular, everything cool, and my career is on a level. Mm -hmm. You understand? So, you sound like a man loaded with things to say. Yeah. And by that, I mean musically. Musically. You're loaded with music, right? I live it and breathe it. And you want to un you, you're just dying to unleash. You understand? And when you do, the world is going to be. Yeah, man, they got, they got, they got wonder like... Obliterated. You, you have blocked the words. <laughs> you don't even understand me, friend. You don't even, okay. even, even understand. All right, so, so why men cheat? That song, talk mm -hmm. about it. I mean... Um, why that title, what is it? Explain it for us. As I said, why man cheat was a, was a follow-up to Best Friend Girl. Why man cheat? Why man I cheat? I might have said men, but it's man. Man, men, you mm. understand? It, it, it classifies more than one person. Yeah, okay. You understand? Um, meaning women, too. Meaning women, too. Mm -hmm. Kind of no mankind. Human being. <laughs> Human being in general. <laughs> okay. A lot of people don't get that point. You know, yes. I get it. Yeah. You understand? But um, I did just a whole of vibe thinking about what I'm going to do next, what I'm going to say next, and then everybody was like, how oh, we not get no follow up for best friend girl? Yeah, and you know, we link up, we link up Jordan, we link up with Frost at the same speed, we go studio. Like, anytime I see Jordan, me hit. Yes. I can't tell her that. 
Okay. All right, so we can go to the song then now. Yeah, man, we can go to the song. We can go to the song. Not because you wash me sheet and press me close. It's when you push me, give your face, rest me out. Every day in a me skin, I press remote. And then you wonder what made me go cheat. Why you think so every day I'm left the house? Girl, me last me see you in some sexy clothes. Let me, let me drop a sleep and search me phone. And then you wonder what made me go cheat. Okay, then. Why am I cheat? According to OCG, okay? We can't have him fall and get searched. And we can't have him stressed out. Wow. That's it? So you blame the woman for, for what you want to do? No, no, you see, no. You're blaming the woman for your rocks. Wow, that's, that's neat. All right, ladies, let me know how you feel about that. Let me tell you. Cru crucify me as always. Okay. All right, so, so, so it's, uh, it's, this, is, this is getting rotation, I suspect. No, I've heard it's it. hot. I've heard it. So, yeah, it's hot. Um, so, so this is what we will be leading the charge into the last quarter of the year, right? Um, we're going to be dropping other, 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 video, other, other vid visuals, you understand? Yes. Like, as I said, this is a very hot song and it's already there in rotation and doing a lot for itself, you understand? Yeah, so it, wouldn't it be the one paving? Yeah, the man, yeah, yeah, man. Yeah. This, this is the song that is pulling, pulling everything that is, that is dropping. This is the song that's yes. making people, recognizing the songs that we were dropping now, you Same. understand? So, yeah, man, why man cheat, man? Okay, so take us to your roots. Re remind us of where you were born and so on. I'm a, I was born in Kingston. I grew up inside of Westmoreland, you understand? So big up everybody. Mm -hmm. From Savlamar, Westmoreland, you see me as a big up everybody who go morning school, you know, so we blood blue till death. <laughs> you understand? Blue, blue blood. blood. Yes, sir. <laughs> okay. Yes, sir. So, yeah. um, I'm a, a country youth, you see me? Mm -hmm. Big up to my grandmother, big up to my mommy, CM Speed, you understand? That's why the voice is so powerful. No, country man. Voice. From, from, from my grandmother, hear me I sing a melody, she have me by my ears, I sing everywhere. Yeah. She can specifically remember that. As a little youth, six, seven year old, me I sing some country songs, some old Estelle gospel and something. Oh, so yeah. that, that type of range, mm -hmm. I'm, I did them something from a long time. We do the whole JCDC festivals, we do all together sing. We do the whole of them type of something. Church too? You understand? Yeah, yeah, man. yeah, man. You were a church boy? Yeah, me never go to church. Church is a most and more, more, more. Every, every gangster carry a Bible in them pocket. Mm -hmm. Every real gangster. You understand? We love God. Because God principles are what we live by. So who knows answer them never go to church because they want to look cool for them business. I go to church and I have my roots. Big up to grandma because I'm glad I go. Enough mm -hmm. things I learn. You understand? Good and bad. Okay. Mm -hmm. And so what were you thinking about in school? Though you could sing, because it seemed to me that singing for you was so I, natural. I, and yeah, man. Singing for was, me was you're, a, you weren't looking at a career? Were no, you? I was always looking at a career. No. Um, music? I, I, always. Mm -hmm. um, my, 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 my people them never fond of it still. You understand? Um, so what um, did they want you to do? They wanted me to do architecture. I'm ah. a very good, I'm, I'm, I have an associate degree in architecture. You mm -hmm. understand? Um, I'm, I'm very good at paintings. I even do stuff you have on the wall, I can do all of this. You understand? So you dump um, it? No, I don't. Do I, still, I still do, you know, in my, in my, in my time at home. Mm -hmm. Like, people will know me personally. If they come around and see me, I always a sketch and a draw and I do my things. Cool. Yeah, you understand? It's a passion for me too, you understand? Mm -hmm. And it, it even helps me to sing, create ideas for me too. But music is... It's, it's everything. so you. Yeah, man. And everything. just listening to you alone would say, boy, I mean, uh, you, you're like if somebody takes you to music, you'd explode. Like, I'm glad you see that, that type of effect there. Like, it has become so much a part of me. It's like my yeah. skin. It's like everything when I do is because of music. Everything. I don't have a regular life. I can't tell when last I have fun. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't have fun. I give up a regular life to be great. Everything when I do is a sacrifice. Every single thing I'm going to do is a sacrifice. Everything I'm going to do is pain, and everything I'm going to do is a sacrifice. I don't get to do nothing that I want to do. Wow. You're laser focused. You don't even understand. You don't even understand. Even when we have women around, mm -hmm. they come second. Even when you go cheat, you know what I mean? Nothing. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm going to pull off some stunt like that, but everything good. You understand? You see me? Yeah. But, yeah, man, for real, because let me tell you something at the end of the day. You see, if I don't make it, Yes. That's going to be the problem. But you see, when you make it, even those who hate you, half a second. Yeah, well, you know, that you. laser focus, and if you're focusing on the right, and so far, so good, what I've seen and what I've heard, mm -hmm. sounds like you know what you're about and mm -hmm. where you want to go. Mm -hmm. I would be a little softer on the whole thing of nobody can tell me nothing kind of thing. No. I understand that. Yeah. You no. understand exactly what, you, what you're saying. Nobody knows you but you. Ah, right. Okay? Um, Nobody can define you but you. So right. I believe in that. All right. 
And so, so, so when I'm saying what I'm saying, I'm just saying that no man is an island, really. And, 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 and a, little, a little bit of guidance and, and so on will, will make a big difference in, in direction. Because, and what, and okay. what, I, what I wanted to understand, I, I am never a one-man show. Yes. The team is here, Travel Bugs Entertainment. You understand? And me and Sue have conversations. I take talk from Sue. You understand? But mm -hmm. it's talk that makes sense. No, I yes. don't listen to anything that don't make sense. Mm -hmm. that is you will I, push back. I will push back. No, that is what I should have said. It's not yes. like anybody can tell me what to do or whatever. I listen to I think I get. I think I get what you're saying. All but right. it's important that it's you clear it up. Yeah, I clear it up. You that understand? Because I don't want away thinking you're that, right. Yeah. The, the, getting the wrong impression. You understand? Yeah. I'm glad, I'm glad that Eva pointed it out for Eva clarify that. Yeah. I am not a person that you really cannot talk to. But don't come to me with foolishness. Same. Don't come to me under some mind control and, and psychology. I do, do psychology for two years, brother. I mean, he's a major in a psychology. I know it. Yes. At the back of my hand. You understand? If you want a dog to eat, if you want to train a dog, you beat him or you ring a bell. Now, if you have a child in school and you want him to eat, you ring a bell, it's 12 o'clock. The same mm. principle, brother, mm. nothing no change. Whether it's an animal or it's a human being. As I see mind control, I pick it up. I mean, not work with it. So you go where from here? Um, I go Guyana from here. And then I have Belize. Um, I have Canada. I've been in Canada before, for, you understand? Mm -hmm. Big up to Travel Box Entertainment and J-Buds, one syndicate, you understand? Um, if we explain the whole itinerary, we have, we call, we call Guyana, we call Belize, we have Trinidad to go. We have a lot of groundwork doing, mm -hmm. you understand? Um, fresh from Bahamas. Um, it was a crazy vibe there, you see me? Big up to all the Bahamian people, you see me? It was a great pleasure being there. Um, we have videos. Let's, let's go and watch and go and Do you go. have more traction in those markets or anywhere overseas than a you lot, have in Jamaica? A lot. All right, may, may, may I tell you one of the weirdest things? Mm -hmm. Like, even when you reach, people go crazy. Yes. Like, people go crazy when they, when they actually know. So, yo, I OCG that, like, for real. And then the love outside, like, I always hear artists talk. The love outside of your country is tremendous. Mm -hmm. People hug you, them squeeze you, them, you can feel the natural love. And they're happy to see you, they're happy to hear you when they hear you. And it's, it's awesome, man. Before you go, the name OCG, tell, explain it for me. I mean, growing up, um, I was always called OC, and separately my friends them used to call me G. Or they used to say OCG or OG. Actually means overcurrent generation, means a generation that's always sticking together. Overcurrent generation. Or always Jenna. Sticking. Overcurrent Jenna. Jenna. <laughs> right. OCG, sir, it's, it's great having you. We love the energy and the passion, but still to come right here on our stage, a man with an impressive profile in music, but has he really been able to live up to that profile? I think it is when the evil wanna get you down. We're talking about Versi and he's next and later. We have the treasure. Lisa Hyper with her treasures on our stage. We have the treasure. Reaching more and more screens around the world every week. On stage, so much more than entertainment. His profile on paper is quite impressive, but has he been able to live up to that profile in reality? And why is he tampering with his moniker? Life too sweet, something added. Versus on our stage right now with the voice, which includes the warlord, Bounty Killer. Versi, blessed love, sir. Blessed love. Good to have you. So, um, you were founded by Baby Sham, right? Yeah. And Discovered by Baby Sham. <laughs> you know <what> I mean? <laughs> Discovered. Yeah. Okay. So, you were Versi before, or were you I named was, after? I was Little Shatter back then. Right? Yeah. So, so who gave you the name? Versi. Yeah. And my mother was the per first person who suggested that name. Okay. And then another uh, producer suggested called Maria C. Same. Yeah, and it was just a confirmation. As a so you were recognized as an artist? Definitely. Before. But you got exposure in terms of recordings and professional, professional exposure through who? Sham. Baby Sham. Right. And so Beanie Man. Baby Sham introduced me to the stage, mm -hmm. and Beanie Man introduced me to the recording. Oh, I see what you mean. And yeah. the warlord? Bounty Killer is just, it's just recently now me and, me and Killer start link. You know okay. I mean? so we, just, we just did a song, but I, I've written a song for him also before. So all, all along you were Sham, um, Sham's protege. 
yeah, but far, we're far, not far, getting far. any any support directly from the the ground guard. No, yes, I would say yes. <laughs> See me, okay. you know, always, killer always. You don't know, always I give advice and thing and, and recognize the talent. Yes. You see me? You don't know. I, I, he's the born to killer, and him see what I go on. So you have got. What I go on. So you have gotten what many are looking for: support from the best. I would the, say the best names: here, the King Bounty, yeah. Bini, yeah, Warlord, Sham. You name it. I mean, when you when your name, when yeah, one man. looks at your profile, wow! Who hasn't mm. given you some support? So what have you done with all of that? All of that support. Do, do you think you've exploited exploited it well? Yeah, sure. I, I've been working, working a lot and, and been consistent over the years. Mm -hmm. you know what I mean, in the business and putting out songs and working hard. But it's just that yes. it's a next level I think I go on right now. Okay, so you've been at a certain level for a long time. Yes. So to like stagnant, would you say? I wouldn't say stagnant, but you know, we, we just... Did we just ascend to a different level now? Okay, so you're on a, a trajectory that is ascension at the moment. But I just want to go back to yeah. what kept you in this place in this place yeah, for um, so long because of the support you've got. Yeah. One would have expected that you would have been, you know, more of a front runner mm. or more in the foreground. Um, you know what I mean? But but anyway. Maybe you can tell us about your recordings so far. Maybe should be, it should be. Maybe should be. Uh, be, but you don't know nothing not before the time. Same. And we always been working, and it, it's just that certain th certain things that get in place. Mm -hmm. You don't know we are, we are powered artists, and we are support just like oh we get support from them. We've been supporting artists also. Okay. As I've been writing songs over the years for artists. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And maybe I was, wasn't just focusing on solely my career. See? You know what I mean? So much of your work yes. has been filtered through others. Sure. You, lyrics and yes. style. Can't you be grooming. A lot, so though. you're actually grooming your groomers. <laughs> your coaches are being coached. By. Yeah, you can't say that. You know what I mean? Uh, I understood. No, yeah. well, you see, sometimes we look at, if we don't see you in the front line. Yeah. And you're a recording star and all for, and the hype and what have you. Mm -hmm. well, it is assumed that no, no, go on for you. Well, yeah, it's yeah, important, yeah, yeah. you know, because yeah. the, the behind the scene work is important. Mm -hmm. But we often don't, don't see. in our space, give cre um, credit to those who work behind the scene, the yes. producers. Yes, and sometimes they are the most important ones. Absolutely. Because they are the ones who are, who are making the best of what they've got. Yes. Or bringing the best out of yes. you, the recording yes. artist. Tell us, tell us about your recordings. What are the ones you know? Um, 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 one of the time I was managed by Ramesh, you know. Ramesh Entertainment. Ramin, yes. He came here one time and he even mentioned that I was the first artist he, he managed. Yes. I mean, and I, 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 my, I would say my breakout song at the time is Bank in My Pocket. Bank in My Pocket. Under the Ramesh management? Yes. Okay. You know what I mean? I also written a song for Bounty Killer and that with him, which, which my song was the leading song. You know what I mean? And mm -hmm. then after that, we have songs like Made it, on the ends. Made it is produced by me. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Because I established my own production and own company right now. You know what I mean? So it's just been, been we have songs with Beanie Man. We have songs with with um, Ayakteen. Yeah. And we have, we have songs out there. You know what I mean? And if you ask the mass, they they know me. Okay, you know so mean? the mass know you. Yeah, and, sure. And thing. But you, that massive breakout song, not come yet. Not forward yet. But, but it's, it's, it's there now, it's coming now. Yeah, uh, not to worry. Mm -hmm. you, you just be honest about it. Don't yeah, worry. Sure. If you're confident as you sound right now about your talent, mm -hmm. you should not let anyone define you but you. Only you can define you, my friend. Precisely. So don't worry about saying out loud, you know, get that breakout yet. Because if you say that, it means that you understand mm -hmm. that there's a higher place to go. As you were saying, the ascension is that. Mm -hmm. And one song with your bass and your catalog and your work and experience that you've garnered over the years yes 
will not be, you'll be a force in no time to reckon with if you get that one song now. A force to in, give. In, sh in short space of time too. And could this be it? Could we have it chewed up right now? Yeah, yeah, is, yeah. This, this, is, this is one of the songs. This one is yes, one of them. Definitely that, one of the songs. Okay. But this is a collaborative effort, so. Them, no, no matter. Yeah. The warlord is on it already. It's, yeah. It's it's Godzilla. So, so is, it, is the first one with him? No? Yeah, yeah, my first song with him. The first one with him. Mm. Let's go to it, right? You think it easy when the evil wanna get you down? And the eagle wanna make you sound. You think it's easy but to hear that voice from all around. Think it easy when the evil wanna get you down. And the eagle wanna make few sounds. You think it's easy but to hear that voice from all around. Mercy with the voice. Mm -hmm. It's a nice sound. Nice. I kinda like the tune. I, I like the concept of the video. Yeah, yeah, the you ground kinda, guard, you I kinda like it. I, I like. want a reason with the, with the grown god. It's yeah. a good song. Yeah, one. You know what I mean? Thanks, uh, it's the kind of song that we need to have played in the yeah, definitely in the jugglings, so we can remind people that you know mm -hmm. the voices that they're hearing. Uh, Sometimes our voice are talk to you. We need to listen to. Right. You know? And this song was was produced by me. Yeah, we produced production. Produced by me. Yeah, man. It yeah. sounds good. And, and our co-producer would would um, Chris Rock from Hard Rock Entertainment. So, Bridging, you have every right then to say that this is this, this one is, will, yeah. is one of them. It's one of the bomb. Could be the one. Yes. Okay. So we are saying then that you're making sure that you, s you stamp your name on the last quarter of 2018 before it goes off. Right? Yeah, man. Sure. And this is one of what? This is one of the songs. One of the songs. And I have another song, which um, um, the video is coming very soon, called Same. Three Card Man. Same. Yeah. All right, sir. Look out for that one. So you're on a roll, Versi. Yeah, man. Well, I'll leave the rest till when you come back here, sir. Sure, you'll see me again. Yeah, man. Very soon, too. We're going to leave some of it till yeah. when you come again. Because yeah. we want to make the music speak first. Yeah. And win souls and, and so on. And then we, di we dig deeper into who, how you got here, my friend. All right. Blessed love, yeah? Man, enough is Bless again. Nice. All right, there you have him in this segment. Versi on our stage looking to make... His mark, a bigger mark in music in the last quarter of 2018. All right, up next, right here on our stage, Lisa Hyper with her treasures. Wow. Me love the treasure. Me love the treasure. Ooh. Me love the treasure. Reaching more screens around the world every week on stage so much more than entertainment now lisa hyper may not have been among the hot names of summer 2018 but is definitely not out of the dance or game for now that the summer is winding down the former first lady of gaza no squad pull up a child seeks to be at the forefront of the last quarter with her treasures, lots of it. Right now, right here on our stage, Lisa Hyper. Wow, in all her glory. Take a good look, take a look first before we talk. Wow, Lisa. How you been? I'm fine. I don't want to ask you. Because yeah. you're, you're wearing it. <laughs> you're wearing fine all over you. Let me ask you something. Yes. You're not age. Oh, really? I'm, yeah. I'm, you're not age, man. I thought I looked so old. No, sir. No, I'm all right. <laughs> I'm doing well. <laughs> My goodness. Well, let me give you all the compliments in the world, sweetheart. I thought Rupert says, is that Beyonce? That's the Rupert. Okay, so you, you, where do you live now? You live here? Yes, I, I do. I do live here. You're in and out. You're in and out. Yeah, in and out a lot. In and out a lot. Yeah, you know, basically, you know, working on a lot of content, you know, mm. you know, my craft totally different. You know, I'm always outside the box. Yes. You know, not try fit in. So basically, you know, I just came back. Um, you know, I left to do the treasure video and I actually left to um, work with a producer called Mark Henry, mm -hmm. you know, that works with Wiz Khalifa, uh, Fat Joe, Fabulous, Nicki Minaj. So oh. I did some recordings with him in Washington, D.C. I had to cut it short because, you know, I have a song called Loser Man that is doing very good and, you know, they are ready to shoot the video. So I had to come back plus Tifa Peace video. So are we talking about crossover hip-hop flavored kind of... 
um, mm. projects. Yeah, one of the songs, you know, one of the songs that's going to be released first is called Lisa Left Eye. Mm. You know, so you, from your ear, Lisa Left Eye, you definitely know it's crossover. You know, um, it has a dancehall instrument in it. You remember that Showtime? Yes, yes. The instrument, yeah, so it has that a piece of Showtime in it too, but it, it, it's crazy, it's fire. So they're seeking you out in the hip hop community. Yeah, yeah, and that's what I need. I'm actually writing too for record labels over there. You know, I just wrote a song um, with Broke Up for Chris Brown and Ashanti. Mm. You know, so I wrote Ashanti's part. You know, so I, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm venturing off like in different, you know, areas of because I am a musician. Yes. Yeah, so yeah. Nice. Well, you know, that's this just did it for me. Just hearing that. You're still, as we say, we, well, we know that you're still in the games uh, and so on, but and may not be on the local scene, because we're talking more uh, about the local Jamaican mm -hmm, scene mm -hmm. in terms of summer, because, you know, summertime, everybody comes home and wants. Well, actually, the same song, you know, the same two songs that I, I came down mm -hmm. to video, the Loser Man song and Global Warming with him is doing very, very well. You know, because I've been getting calls when I'm over there, you know, that the song is playing real hard. And then, you know, the Tifa P song, it had dominate the streets. Big up to Rooksy and Carter, big up Boom Boom, World Boom, Ari Hype, big up Game Changers, you know, big up to all of the radio distracties, Sunshine, the Liquid, you know, everybody, you know, that play a part and contribute, you know, to, to my career. Okay, so your treasures are out of the box. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's, let's, take, let's take this one right here. Okay, so that's that's a tackle track, okay? You are of all the treasures. <laughs> I'm Lisa's treasure is right now. The title of it. What a song. The treasure. Yeah, you. We have the treasure. I agree. So, so this is out now and, and about? Yes, it's out. You know, um, you know, the lady is going crazy for the Calvin Klein model in it. Yes. Um, you know, everybody, even the man there, me and the treasure, you know, <laughs> singing along. So it's yes. doing very well. Um, you know, I, I, I did release the Griselda Blanco mixtape. Um, you know, the boss of EP before I left the other day. And um, as I said, I'm here to shoot the Loser Man and the Tifa Peace video. That's, that's going very well right now in the streets and on the radio. So as I said before, I just want to thank everybody, you know, big up Bruce Lee, um, my team, you know, both here and overseas, you know, my marketing team as well, yes. Thank you very well, much. Well, yeah, they, everything sounds so good. I mean, yeah. you're, no, I gotta, you're... I gotta give thanks. And I just wanna say, you know, much respect, you know, to all the female entertainers, whether young, new, even those who are not established, you know, that mm -hmm. is, that are, that, that are contributing to dancehall music. You know, we need as much female as possible, you know, in the music. And, and, and let's get out of the box. Let's yes. get out of the box. Because trust me, they my plan for take dance all from way for never know. Let's get out of the box. Please and thank you. Ah, so that's a direct message to all you youngsters, the new arrivals mm -hmm. in dance hall, right? Yes, yes. And so do you like where I see though? You like the, yes, the yes, emergence yes, of women? Yes, and yes, and I love it. Yes. I love it. I love it. And they are doing quite a number of them trust are doing me, pretty well. I love it. I love it. And the the, the shuffling at the top. Mm-hmm. Of Lady Saw, your friend. Yes, I saw her the other day. Oh my, I wish you. <laughs> yeah. And she was, she was, we had her recently, and she's, mm -hmm. you know, she has the same. Me see the enemy day. Yes. She, I come from afar. She's, she's converted mm -hmm. the, um, She's carried all her energy, dance all energy to mm -hmm. gospel. I, I don't Just think I've ever seen it. something you feel, so. You feel it, right? Yeah, it's, it's so it's, powerful. It's absolute, in fact, if anything, she has more energy now that she's giving to gospel. And, and it, uh, it amazes me because I, I knew, you know, I knew that she wanted, you know, to be there. Mm -hmm. She wanted to be there so bad, you know. So you know, to see that she's actually there and she's peaceful and she's happy in it, 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 it just yes. gives, it gives me an overwhelming feeling knowing, you know, 
how far she has come and what she has, you know, been through. Mm -hmm. so, so it's just, yeah, it's not just Lady Saw who is converted. No. Her catalog, her talent, uh, the, I, I, everything is converted. Yeah. Her, her talent is also converted and now fully and blazing hot gospel. I, 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 I wasn't going to come back home without that album. I made, I made sure I got that album. Oh, yeah. yeah. Spice is now the new queen, some are calling her. You say? Me say. <laughs> say you say? Me <laughs> well, basically, I, I, you know, I, 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 it's not my place to give any take on any other female career. I just want to, you know, contribute them, you know, thank them for their contribution, you know, to dance all. But I'm not going to go in depth in that, you know, Into, because, yeah. Okay, you understood. Know, you know, I, I already, you know, give my respect to marry and all, you know, and the queen title. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm just here to fulfill my purpose and give my fans, you know, my creativity that I have for them. Spice has got a huge um, support behind the, the, the notion that um, she's queen now. Because uh, this is not she taking it, um, per se, but it was vacated by Lady Saw and when she converted to, to gospel, so. Well, basically, you know, she has been in the business a while now, you know. Paid her you know, dues. Because, you know, you know, even when I was in school, when I was in school, attending school, I was dancing to Spice's Spice song. was out there, So, yes. basically, you know, she it's worked, time. She worked hard, <laughs> it's, it's time. So, as I said, the lady them just go and do the thing, go and turn up the thing, mash up the place, and, you know, make the man them get shaky. Oh, yes. I love it. I love it. Okay, so when are we going to see you on a stage in Jamaica? I haven't seen well, you live in a while. I, I'm basically, you know, before I left, I did a tribute to Lady Saw. Oh, yeah? By, by 100 Live, and it, was, it went very well. Big up to Shelly and Kuran, you know. That, that's the last performance <laughs> I did, a uh, tribute to her. I'm sorry, I didn't um, get that one. I'm, yeah, the tribute to her, I did that. Um, I will be in Orlando with Tanya Stevens. Paul Campbell, that's Audrey Reed's mm -hmm. birthday party, you know, Audrey okay. Reed, the dance mm -hmm. dance star, queen, the yeah. Igla. Yeah, big up Audrey Reed, so I will be there and then I'm off to Bahamas and then I'm back. So basically, yeah. Yeah, so you, you're you just globe trotting right now with your talent and mm -hmm. your music, mm -hmm. your bag of treasure, so yes, to speak. Yes, yes, yes. And, um, yes. I basically, you know, I have a couple more tracks coming out before the Lisa left tie, because that's mixing right now. Big up to RDX, you know, I'm doing some work with them as well. I have a song coming out for them called Moscato. Yes. You know, so, you know, I have a couple singles going, but right now I'm actually here to shoot the Loser Man and the Tifa Peace video, and then I'm off to Orlando. So you're definitely stamping your, your mark in terms of locally, Jamaica now. Yes, yes, yes. On the last quarter of 2018. Yes. And right? it's, it's good. My fans are so happy. Oh, yes, they should yes, be. They're so happy, yes. You, you, you're, you're energized. You're looking it. <laughs> Thank you. You got treasures in <laughs> your box. I, I what else can we say? <laughs> I you know what I mean? Ahead. Lisa Hyper, it's always so good to have you. Thank it's you. It's always so good to it's see you. It's always so good to be here. Just feel comfortable and nice and welcoming. And oh, wow. See I'm, you go away from my I'm flattered. <laughs> the stage is comfortable and nice. <laughs> wow, you see? Nobody wants to run away from it. Yeah. Where are those who are hiding from us? <laughs> Tell them for me, Lisa. Yeah, it come true, man. Okay, there you have her. Mm -hmm. Lisa Hyper inviting you to our stage. Okay. All right, so that's our show for this week. Winford Williams on behalf of all of us. Thanking you for joining us. Do join us again next week for more on stage. Oh no! Buff up in a shot shot. Nine for the bus pass. The game like a fast pass. In a debut shot, you grab the grass. Buff up in a shot shot. Nine for the bus pass. The game like a fast pass. The game like a fast pass.
Thanks for watching our video. Please click subscribe and be on stage always.